let's look at the lesson Add and Subtract. How to make a number up to 100. The first question is, how do you make 1? Well, let's look at each option. I see they have 10 plus 2. I could draw a picture for this problem, but I know that if I already have 10 and I'm adding more to that, that is going to be more than 10, which is plenty more than 1. So I'm going to cross this one off. This one looks like it might be logical. 10 minus 9 is equal to a number. I'm going to look for some other ones to rule out before checking this one. This one is 10 plus 0. Well, if I have 10 and I add nothing to it, it is still going to be 10. And that is not how we make 1. So let's cross this one off. Now, if I have two dots and I subtract or take away 0 or none of them, we will still have 2. So I'm going to cross this one off. Well, now I have 10 minus 9. Let's double check to make sure this one is true. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And I will subtract or take away 9. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. I am left with 1. That is the number we were looking for. Next, they ask, how do you make 4? Well, if I see that I have 5 here and I am adding 4 more, I know that is already going to be more than 4. So I'm going to cross this one off. 5 minus 1. Let's check into that one. But let's keep going before we do. 5 plus 6. Well, I know that 5 and 6 are both more than 4. So if I add them together, the answer is going to be more than 4. So that is not it. Here we have 6 minus 4. So let's try that one. Let's draw 6 dots. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. And let's subtract 4. 1, 2, 3, 4. I'm only left with 2. So it's not this one either. Let's try this one. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and then we take away 1. We have 1, 2, 3, 4. That is the correct option. Next, they ask, how do you make 2? Here we have 4 minus 3. Well, let's check that one. 1, 2, 3, 4. And if we take away 3, 1, 2, 3, we're left with 1. So no, that one is not it. Let's try this one, 9 minus 7. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, minus 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. We are left with just 2. That's the number we're looking for. All right, let's just check into our other ones. 9 plus 3. Well, 9 is already plenty more than 2, and then we are adding more, so I know this is not the correct option. Same with this one. This number is already more than 2, so if we were adding to it, we know that it is not the correct option either. So this is the correct answer. Now they ask, how do you make 3? Well, I'm going to look at the ones that have zeros first because I can rule those out a little bit quicker. 9 minus 0, or nothing, is going to just be 9, so I can cross that one off. 5 plus 0, so we're adding nothing to 5, will still be 5, so that is not the correct one. Here we have 5 plus 9. Well, 5 is already larger than 3, and if we're adding 9 to it, it's going to be much larger than 3, so this is not the correct option either. Let's check this one. Let's draw a picture. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, and then we take away 2. 1, 2. We have 1, 2, 3 left. So this is the correct answer. Now they say, how do you make 5? Well, let's check to see which ones look reasonable. 7 plus 6. Mm, well, 7 is already greater than 5. So if we're adding more to 7, we know this is not the correct option. 7 minus 2. Well, 7 is greater than 5, but we are taking some away from it, so this one might be a possibility. 10 minus 6. Same thing, 10 is greater than 5, but we are taking something away from it, 
so it may be the correct possibility as well. Here we have 7 plus 10. Well, 7 is already greater than 5, and then we are adding to it, so we know the answer will be much greater, so it is not that one. Let's start with 7 minus 2. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, and then we subtract 2. 1, 2. We are left with 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Next we have 10 minus 6. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And we will take 6 away. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. We are left with 1, 2, 3, 4. So which one is the correct option? Yes, 7 minus 2 is equal to 5. All right, how do you make 11? Well, let's see. I know that 7 plus just one more is going to be 8. So that one is not large enough. Now we have 9 and we are going to be taking something away from it. But 9 is already less than 11. So if we're taking something away from it, we're making it even smaller. So it will not be that option either. Same thing with this one. 9 is already less than 11. So we know that taking something away from it is going to make it much smaller. Here we have 9 plus 2. Well, I could draw 9 dots. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, and 2 more. Let's count them all. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. 11. And that is the number we were looking for. This one says, how do you make 9? Well, I recognize that 2 minus nothing is going to still be 2, and 2 is much smaller than 9, so this is not the correct option. Here we have 1 plus nothing, so we're adding nothing to 1, it'll still be 1. That is not the correct option. Here we have 2 minus 1. So we know that 1 less than 2 would just be 1. So this is not the correct option either. Now here we have 2 plus 7. Let's try that one. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, plus 2 more. 1, 2. So that is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. The answer is 9. And that is what we were looking for. Now they ask, how do you make 13? Well, I can see that 0 plus 5 is going to just be 5. So I can cross this one off. Here I have 6 and I am taking away 0 or nothing. So I will still have 6. So that is not the correct option either. Here I have 6 plus 7. Well, I do know my double 6 plus 6 is 12. So 6 plus 7 would be just one more than 12. What is one more than 12? Yes, 13. And that's the number we're looking for. Let's look at our last one just to make sure. 6 minus 5. Well, I know 6 is already smaller than 13, so if we're taking more away from it, we know it will not equal 13. So 6 plus 7 is equal to 13. Now they ask, how do you make 8? Well, let's find some we can rule out first. 1 plus 0. If I add 0 to a number, it will just be that same number. So the answer here is 1, and that is not what we're looking for. We are looking for 8. Here we have 3 minus 0. If we have 3 and we take nothing away from it, we will still have 3. So it is not this one either. Now if we have 3 and we take some away from it, it is going to be less than 3. But 3 is already too small because we're looking for 8, so this is not the option. Here we have 3 plus 5. Let's make sure this is the correct one. 1, 2, 3, plus 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8. That's what we were looking for. Now they ask, how do you make 16? Well, I can see that if we have 10, which is already smaller than 16, and we take something away from it, it's going to be smaller. So we can cross this one off. Here we have 1 plus 4. Well, if I have 1 and then I have 1, 2, 3, 4 more, how much is that? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. Nope, that's way too small. Here we have 10 plus 6. 
oh, if I start with 10 and I just count on six more, one, two, three, four, five, six, let's try that. 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Hey, that's the number we're looking for. Let's check this one just to make sure. 10 minus four. Well, if we have 10 and it's already less than 16 and then we take more away from it, our answer is definitely not going to be 16. So our answer is 10 plus six. Thanks for your help, my friends.